Rejoice now, all heavenly choirs of angels, and celebrate the divine mysteries with exaltation, and for the victory of so great a King, sound the trumpet of salvation. Exalt also, O earth, enlightened with such radiance, made brilliant by the splendor of the eternal King. Know that the ancient darkness has been banished from all the world. Be glad also, O Mother Church, clothed with the brightness of such a light, and let this house resound with the triumphant voices of the people. The Lord be with you. that we should with full devotion of heart and mind and voice praise the invisible God, the Father Almighty, and His only Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, who paid for us the debt of Adam to the eternal Father, and who, by his precious blood, redeemed us from the bondage to the ancient sin. For this indeed is the Paschal Feast, in which the true Lamb is slain, by whose blood the doorposts of the faithful are made holy. This is the night in which in ancient times you delivered our forebears, the children of Israel from the land of Egypt, and led them dry shod through the Red Sea. This is the night in which all who believe in Christ are rescued from evil and the gloom of sin, and are renewed in grace and holiness by the rising brightness. This is the night in which, breaking the chains of death, Christ arises from hell in triumph. O oh, 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 night truly blessed, which alone was worthy to know the time and the hour, when Christ arose again from hell. O oh, oh, night truly blessed, in which heaven and earth are joined, things human and things divine. We therefore pray to you, O Lord, that he in whose honor this candle burns will continue to vanquish the darkness of this night and faithfully shed light on all the human race. Through the same Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you 
in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever.